Hello, my name is Mark Hauser, and I am the Sales Support Director here at Southeastern Equipment. And today I'd like to take a few moments of your time to discuss the new E-Series case excavators with you. We here at Southeastern are very excited about the release of the new E-Series. And again, I'd like to just take a few moments of your time and discuss a few of the features that we feel like benefit you as a customer. So when I always talk to my customers about case excavators, I talk about what I consider or call the three S's, the speed, the smoothness, and the strength of the machine. So how we get that speed and that smoothness is through what's called the Case Intelligent Hydraulic System. It's an axial piston load sensing pump. What that means is that we are just simply redirecting that hydraulic flow to whatever function or load you're putting the machine under. That's allowing us to get that speed and that smoothness. We're not actually making that hydraulic fluid flow all the way back through the pump. It's just redirecting it to whatever function you're putting it under. So the next thing that I would like to talk to you guys about is the engines in these new E-Series. So with the E-Series release, we actually went to the FPT engine in these new case E-Series excavators. This 220 here in front of me has the 67 NEF, which stands for New Engine Family. It is a 67, which is giving you higher displacement, better horsepower, better torque curves, and most importantly, better fuel efficiency. So you're getting more power with better fuel economy. In addition to that, with these new engines, all E-Series come with ProCare included for the first three years or 2,000 hours. But on top of that, we have now gone to 1,000 hour service intervals on the engines. So most of your componentry on this machine as far as filters and fluid changes are now up to 1,000 hours. What personally I am most excited about is this new 10 inch LCD monitor that comes standard in the E-Series excavators. This monitor is incredibly customizable and incredibly intuitive. It is gonna allow you as a owner or an operator to be more efficient, more productive with whatever task you are doing. As I mentioned earlier, with custom flow balance, it is simply a click of the button, and now you can get into this screen and customize the flow on your machine. So you can speed up or slow down your boom in, or boom up and arm in, as well as you can prioritize your swing table or your arm in. So no matter what task you are doing, you can customize the machine for whatever you are trying to accomplish. Let's say you're digging a trench, speed it up. Let's say you're on top of a dirt pile. You're gonna give more flow to your swing table and your boom. This is gonna allow you as a customer to be more productive, more comfortable with the operation of the machine. Another feature that's included in this screen, these buttons down here now are customizable. So you can custom tune this screen and put whatever shortcuts you would like on it. And finally, your joysticks. You are now able to program the buttons on your joystick to whatever you feel fit as a customer. So let's say you want to have one touch wiper on your joystick. You can do this very simply by hitting a feature through this screen. And lastly, what I'd like to discuss is the new power modes that are available in these E-Series excavators. We now have what's considered eco mode, power mode, speed priority, and lifting. Eco mode is going to give you the best fuel economy for the machine. In eco mode level 10, you're going to save about 5% fuel economy over power mode. In addition, in eco mode, you can save anywhere from 5 to 16% fuel over any of the power mode functions. So, the way that we do this is by simply clicking a button, you can go from eco to power. In both eco and power mode, you have infinite settings from 1 to 10 allowing you to truly fine-tune the machine to whatever environment you're putting it through. To get to speed priority, simply turn it one more click and you get into speed priority. Speed priority, if you're familiar with the old D-Series, is really meant for maxing out this machine. Let's say you're sitting on top of a dirt pile, you want the fastest cycle times possible, you are going to max this machine out for its productivity. And finally, lifting mode. By clicking this button here, it puts you into lifting mode. You have settings one through six, which is really meant for craning operations, setting pipes, setting structures. You don't need high RPMs, but you do need that relief pump pressure to crane your items. It's giving you that fine tuning ability to lift and crane while still having the power as well. 